The regent and president of the Nanum traditional area in the northern region, members of the Nanum traditional council, and the regents of Bimbela, Na Yakubu, and Dani Dasana were at the Jubilee House in Accra. Put on the table by the regent before President Ekufuado was the issue of political and administrative divisions, which has resulted in some Nanum towns falling into the space of Uti region due to the creation of the new regions. He believes this is affecting the allegiance of those towns to the Nanum Traditional Council. President Ekufuado charged the Minister for Chieftaincy and Religious Affairs to look into the matter for a workable solution to resolve the conflict of political and administrative divisions and chieftaincy allegiances. This is the first time in many years that the Nanum Traditional Council is paying a courtesy call on the President. The high power delegation of chiefs and traditional leaders from the Nanum traditional area to the Jubilee House was led by the regent of Bimbila and president of the Nanum traditional council, Naya Kubu and Dani Dasana. They came to thank President Kufada for the numerous development projects in the area, the maintenance of peace in Bimbila, and also to discuss matters of mutual interest. Naya Kubu and Dani Dasana requested for the upgrading of the Bimbila hospital to meet the standard of a municipal hospital. He requested for the construction of a training school in Nanum. He also appealed to President Kufuado to intervene in the political and administrative divisions and chieftaincy allegiance of the country, which has resulted in some Nanum traditional towns falling into the space of Uti region, a situation he says affecting the Nanum traditional council. This particular problem might be common to many other kingdoms or traditional areas. There is a confusion we need to address. To some political heads about traditional and administrative boundaries. We have challenges regarding our lands at Oti region. Example, Punache, Abunyanya, and many more. The Nanumba Traditional Council go through stress in dealing with issues at these areas. As some tribes like Achutis, Shiaris, want to take advantage of that to claim our lands. The Pasana has been duly and skinned as the Pasana, no. and he has been gazetted. No. And now, because it's now OT region, no. he needs to move to the OT regional house of chiefs. No. And he has been going through a lot of sabotage no. just because he doesn't belong to no. Krati Traditional Council. President Kufuado said government will look into this and address the discord between political and administrative divisions and the chieftaincy allegiance. I think you've raised one of the very big points, difficulties about governance in our country. This distinction and the conflict sometimes between the political and administrative divisions of the country and the traditional allegiances and the customary uh, rights that there are for given peoples. It can sometimes pose some conflict and indeed even generate some tensions. And uh, so far in our governing system, our governance system, we haven't found a satisfactory way of dealing with it. But it is a matter where somebody like the chieftaincy minister who's an experienced political figure uh, and, and these people, they have to find a way of coming to grips with. Because I can understand the point that you're making. The lands that have been in the ownership of your people for a long time, but are no longer part of the administrative district which you belong to. And that in itself gives rise to all kinds. And you have unscrupulous people who make, uh, who use this, these, these uh, uh, divisions to advance their own personal interests. And we, we have to find a way um, to deal with it. I think it's a very important matter. Uh, and with the interact where all the 22 parliamentary heads of the Nanum Traditional Council, political heads and government appointees in the area. Also present were the Ministers for Defence, Mr. Dominic Nitu, National Security, Mr. Abad Kandapa, and Chieftaincy of Religious Affairs, Mr. Stephen Asamoah-Bolting.